Good morning, Miss Sonia here for another edition of Call Your Kids Read. Happy Friday. So today we're going to talk about animals in the jungle and going on safari. And our first book is a pop-up book. It's called Pop-Up Jungle. And it is written by Patrick Watson and illustrated by Richard Devrell. And it is published by Top Story, which is an imprint of Robert Frederick Limited. And we want to thank them for allowing us to read this book. Pop-up jungle. Of all the jungle creatures, the lion is the king. Let me hear your best lion roar. Roar! But look out for the monkey from the branch to branch, he will swing. Swing in the monkey in the tree. The elephant's enormous, the biggest of them all. Ooh, look at that elephant. A giraffe without his great long neck would be just half as tall. Oh, the crocodile is vicious. His teeth go snap, snap, snap. Ooh, look at those teeth. The flamingo is so beautiful when she gives her wings a flap, flap, flap. We have flamingos in Florida, don't we? Yeah. The spider spins a web to catch a passing fly. Oh, the zebra's hide is stripy. It's striking to the eye. Ooh, the snakes, they slither. They slip and they slide. Ooh. Look at all the colors. The tiger roars. Oh, you better run and hide. Look at all the animals running away. Good story. Yeah, that's a good one, isn't it? Pop up jungle. I like that. Okay, let's sing a song. This is one of our favorite songs about the jungle. And we like to do this one in story time. So it's row, row, row your boat. So we're going to row, row, row your boat gently down the stream. But if you see an alligator, don't forget to scream. And you can scream as loud as you want. Okay? All right, here we go. Row, row, row your boat gently down the stream. If you see an alligator, don't forget to scream. Ah! Let's do it again, okay? Row, row, row your boat gently down the stream. If you see an alligator, don't forget to scream. Ah! Your mom's going to come running and see what you're screaming about, right? That's a good one. Okay, let's read another story. This one is a sounds book. I love this book. This one is called Safari Sounds. And this book is written by Susan Ring and illustrated by John Kranzler. And we want to thank Innovative Kids for this book. I like this book a lot. Hey, open up your listening ears. I have a long trunk that I use to make a loud trumpet sound. What am I? Let's see. Listen. See if you can guess. Oh. What is that? Let's hear it again. Oh, I bet you know. Oh, right, it's an elephant. Good job. Let's do the next one. I love to make faces and lots of noise as I swing from tree to tree. What am I? Let's see. <gasps> what is that? Let's see. <gasps> Ooh, it's a chimp, a chimpanzee. Some people call that a monkey, yeah. I have a funny laugh, but I'm a deadly hunter with strong teeth and jaws. What am I? Ooh, let's see. <laughs> what is that? Does it almost sound like laughing? <laughs> You're right. It's a hyena. Ooh, we learned about hyenas in The Lion King, didn't we? Yeah. I'm a really big cat, and some people call me the king of the beast. What am I? 
Let's see. <gasps> if you've been to the Naples Zoo, you've seen this. What is it? <gasps> the king of the jungle is the lion, right? Okay, let's see the next one. I have a long furry tail and a long snout on my very hairy face. What am I? Let's see. Oh my goodness, what is that noise? Oh, this one's hard, isn't it? I'll do it one more time. Let's see. Oh, a baboon. I fly high in the air, always looking down for a tasty meal to eat. What am I? Let's see this one. Might see these in Florida. Let's see. Oh, it's a vulture. Ooh. We saw those in the Lion King too, right? I run with the herd for miles and miles, but you'll see only stripes as I'm going by. What am I? What animal has stripes? Did you know they make this noise? Zebra. Okay, here's the last one. This one's really hard. I'm a big and heavy and I love to spend all day swimming in the river. What am I? Let's see. Whoa. One more time. Oh, I'm a hippo. Isn't that a fun story? Safari sounds. I like that one, right? Okay, we have a flannel board today, and this flannel board is called Five Little Zebras. Let's count them. We have one, two, three, four, five. Five little zebras and no more. One winter grays. Oh, and then there were only one, two, three, four. Four little zebras saying, nay. One galloped away, and then there were only one, two, three. Three little zebras looking for something to do. One chased a lion away, and then there were only one, two. Two little zebras starting to run. One was faster, zoom, and then there was only one. One little zebra looking for his friends. He ran away. Now no more zebras, and that's the end. Thank you guys for coming today. I hope you enjoyed all of our stories about animals in the jungle. Be sure next week, June 1st, to check out our website because that is when our summer reading program starts. Or if you want to come into the library, the Naples Regional Library, the South Regional Library, and the Headquarters Library will be open, and you can come in and pick up information about the summer reading program. Uh, our summer reading program is called Imagine Your Story, and it's going to be lots of fun, and it's all the way from zero to uh, a high school. So be sure and come in, check out our programs, and we'll see you next week. Have a good weekend. Bye.